Hey folks, got something really interesting over here on my grill. Recently, I had a hankering for some uh, jalapeno poppers and something popped into my head and that was easy cheese. I've made jalapeno poppers a number of different ways and uh, I'm a big fan of the easy cheese and I love jalapeno poppers so I decided to uh, combine the two. So let's see how this is going to turn out and uh, here's how I put it together and then stay tuned and uh, when they are done I'll take them off the grill, give them a taste, see how good they are. So stay tuned. Okay, when preparing the uh, jalapenos, I suggest using rubber gloves. These aren't that spicy, but you don't want any of that in your eyes. Now we're just going to core out the jalapeno. This is a special tool that I bought for coring out jalapenos. It does a good job. Get all those seeds out because the membrane in the seeds is what's really spicy. Okay, we're all set to go here. Got our jalapenos. And this is the rack. It actually came with that uh, coring tool. So now we're going to fill our jalapenos with some easy cheese. Yeah, easy poppers here. Now, after, on consideration, I thought about maybe... Uh, Next time, not filling them all the way to the top. You'll see later. But it's easy to fill them with that uh, easy cheese, that's for sure. And this is easy cheese cheddar. Now we're going to add some bacon. Just wrap it like this. This These are half, half strips of bacon, which were fine for the, these size jalapenos. And then secure it with a toothpick. Okay, we're ready for the grill. Make sure they're down there nice and snug. There we go. Okay. To the grill. Okay, I've got the uh, the left and the right burner on. The center is off and they are both on medium. So I'm going to let this go probably... Probably around 40 minutes. I'll keep checking on it to see if the bacon is done. And then uh, I'll bring you back. Okay, it's been about 40 minutes, 45 minutes. Some of the cheese did bubble over, but that's okay. The bacon is all done. Jalapenos look nice and soft. Let's let this rest, let it cool down, and then give it a taste. Okay, they're cooled down. Like I said, I don't want to bite into a molten hot lava cheese. So, I decided to bring out some tortilla chips because I think, you know, this is almost like a, a, a nacho situation. And I'm going to take this one here because it looks the prettiest. Make sure to remove that toothpick before biting. Certainly smells good. Bacon is done. Jalapenos are completely done. What do you think? It's pretty good. Now the taste. Whoa. I got to finish this out. So good. Definitely need a chip. So good, so good. I'm surprised I didn't think of this sooner, but yeah, easy cheese, jalapenos wrapped in bacon. You can't go wrong. The the jalapeno, nice and soft. I, I love grilled jalapenos. The flavor is incredible. The bacon is incredible. And that cheese did really well. And definitely, I think next time. I won't overload it so I don't get all this spillage, but hey, that's okay. That's fine. Well, there you have it, folks. Easy poppers. Thanks for watching.